Hey guys, this is Lafi, and today I wanted to give you my thoughts on the Lost Ark drama. It's annoying. Can I show you my collection of Mobile Suit Gundam Gunpla toys? Okay, let's. we're gonna start over here. So this is first half, that over there is the other half, but we'll get to that. We'll get to that. This is, uh, this is, this right here is Gundam Exia. It's uh, Master Grade Gundam Exia. I haven't built this one yet because uh, I haven't had the time. But it's uh, it's it's a Master Grade. This is a mobile suit uh, from uh, the standalone anime Gundam Zero Zero. You can watch it without uh, watching anything else, uh, and you'll be fine. Uh, this one is really cool because it has a melee weapon and a shield and a bunch of other shit. But it's like a melee Gundam, so it's really cool. Um, yeah, this one. Uh, so from the same anime. This one also, I also have not built this one because I haven't had the time. This one is called Gundam Curio. So that other one, Exia, is uh, a melee Gundam. This one transforms into a fucking airplane. It transforms into a space airplane. You see the fucking shoulders that it has? Yeah, that's because it transforms into an airplane and it can transport other mobile suits on top of itself. That's how cool it is, but it still has a double barreled fucking beam that it can blast shit with in space. Um, so you, yes, Gundam 00, that's where Kira is from, and Exia, you can watch it without watching anything else. The main storyline, the main universe, takes place um, in UC, that's where these fellows are from. I don't have them on a stand because I bought a stand, but it was too small. Uh, too small. This one up here, that's Unicorn. That is the main boy. That is the main boy. This is Lux of the Gundam franchise. Uh, I have him built right here. It is a, also a master grade. Um, it just He just doesn't have his combat shit open. You can just open it uh, by itself if you want. I just have him in the... In like, more peaceful mode and then this is its brother unit mobile suit uh banshee it is verka it is a little bit more advanced slightly more advanced a little bit more details on it but it's essentially the same thing it's also a master grade and that fella is right here you can barely see him because it's it's so dark they are essentially the same thing and this is unicorn these fellas are the same but this is a baby version it's called sd so i have three sd versions here I have SD Banshee, which I just showed you. I have the SD Unicorn, which I also just showed you. And then I have the SD Exia, uh, which is this one right here, but baby version. So you've seen it. And then from that universe, the main universe of Gundam, uh, you can also, there is a this iconic mobile suit. It's not actually uh, technically not a Gundam. It's just a mobile suit because it's not a Gundam. It's from the uh, Zeon Federation or Zeon Federation. It's from the Principality of Zion. Sorry, the Federation is the Earth Federation. My bad. Um, this is the Zaku 2. It's a very iconic uh, mobile suit design from um, what many people consider the enemy. But truly, in war, um, there are no good sides in war. So this is, uh, this is actually my only high grade. Typically, when if you want to get into Gunpla, I would recommend starting uh, with a high grade. They're usually a little bit cheaper, a little bit smaller. Let's see how much? How much is this one? Uh, Thirty-three dollars uh, Canadian, which in US is probably like twenty-eight cents. This one, these all the other ones are uh, called master grades, so they're a little bit more expensive. But all that means is that they're going to be a little pricier. And there's gonna be more de like more like uh, little thingies to them. Like there's there's more parts to assemble. None of this involves glue or anything like that. They all snap together like adult Legos. Um, so these are these are master grades. Honestly, if you get a high grade, it's pretty cheap. It'll probably be a little bit shorter than this. It'll be a little bit smaller, but it's a it's a great way to get into the hobby. Uh, you don't need anything. Uh, the only things I would recommend to have as tools is this. Um, it's a clipper. They come when you open the box. They come in uh, these like I can't open it. Open it. They come in essentially um, these these. 
like planes and this is where all the parts you see all the little different parts so you would use these 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 clipper fellas right here to like clip them clip them off of the the thing i forget there's a name for it but i forget what it's called um you would you would this is a, a better preview you would just clip them off and then the little the little nibs that would be left one of these bad boys literally five bucks gets you like a million of these it's just a little sand fella and you just sand down the the little nib that's left and it's got they've got like their they've got weapons they've got decals they've got like stickers and shit you can you can pose them you can assemble them there's no glue this is literally all you need this is all i used to assemble these nothing else is involved and you can get a high grade. Don't feel obligated to get a master grade just because they look cool. They do look cool. If you have the money, get them. They're really fun. They're not more complex. Like they are, but that doesn't make them harder. You, you'll still be able to assemble them easy. Even my first, this was my first one that I've ever built. This one right here. My first, but ever in my life. And it was easy. It just, it took me like three different sittings of like over four hours each or something like that. This one was like two. This little fella is a, it's a, it's a baby, so this one, you can do it in one. But uh, yeah, high grade is just not going to take as long. Um, it's really cool, and it's a very cheap hobby. Uh, and hobbies are very important for enrichment of your life. Uh, it is a small investment so that you're not miserable. So I recommend it. Get into Gumpla. Thanks.